What's up? Um, I just got a package. I know I just posted a boxing of the Canon M50 Mark II. I returned that camera. Um, I was like, okay. I don't want the same exact camera, and it's not even the same exact camera as the M6 Mark II. It's actually got less features and specs. So, for the wedding, and you know, I booked two more uh, photography jobs as well. I picked up the Sony ZV-E10. So it's supposed to be just like the camera I'm filming on right now, which is the ZV-1, but better because it has like interchangeable lenses. So I've had the 6400, I had the 7 A7R2 for a hot minute, and I had the A5000 way back when, and the A6300, I think. Oh, well, Sony cameras. Okay, so here we go. Here it is. I am going to Best Buy today also to get a lens for it. Like an actual like good lens, not just the kit lens. It's got a little floofy. Um, we got a charger. Um, and we have the camera. I did get it in white. I've always, always, always wanted a camera in white, but they've never been available. Like I wanted my Canon M50 in white. I did want the ZV-1 in white, but people just always snatch them up. So, oh my gosh. Look how cute that is. I love it in white. I've always been, like, in the past worried that it's not going to look professional if it's in white, but I don't care if you're going to spend this amount of money on a camera. You've got to love it. Got to love it. I even thought about, like, returning <laughs> my ZV-1 for a hot second there to get the white one then I was like that's too much that's a little that's too much because Best Buy has their like restocking fee so I would have to still owe them money even after <laughs> just exactly exchanging the camera for a different color so I was like nope that's dumb that's dumb I'm just gonna get a white case and pretend like I got the white one okay so I'm actually going to charge this I'm gonna put a little floofy on top. Um, I am gonna do, I'm gonna continue this video after I go to Best Buy later and do an unboxing for you guys of the lens that I pick up. And then I'm also gonna film a vlog on this. So yeah, that stick around for like the next two seconds and um, see which lens I picked up. Actually, I may turn this into like a little vlog style and bring you guys to Best Buy with me. I will have both of the kids at Best Buy, so that'll be interesting. Let's see how long it takes to charge this. How do I... Hello? How do I do this? All right, there's the mic port. Oh, this just flips open. I'm just dumb. Oh, it's USB-C. Oh, that's so interesting. How do I know it's charging? Is there a little light? The ZV-1 has light. Oh, this one does have light. Okay. So it's charging. I don't think it comes with any battery. Um, it's so cute though. Like, I can't wait to use this. Okay, I'm gonna leave that charging in the box right now because I'm gonna take a shower. I just got home from work. I'm gonna put all this paperwork in this, throw all this away. Put the camera strap down there. Alright. So I am gonna take a shower and change my outfit and then I'll probably see you at Best Buy. I'm so excited. Um and I also have to stop at the bank. So yeah. Oh I know this is supposed to be like an only tech video, but this is what it is. And I do what I want because it's my channel and this is my video. I got a nice chai with pumpkin cream foam. I don't know why you guys had to know that, but I had, I felt like I had to tell you that. <sighs> All right, I'm going to go take a shower because I'm never alone without the kids. So let's take advantage of this moment. <laughs> okay, so guys, so I did not film in Best Buy, but I had two kids and I just tried to get in and get out. Um, so 
I got the Sony 11 millimeter f1.8. The one thing I did realize about the Sony ZV-E10 is that when you flip this out, your mic jack is right here. And that's not going to work for the little microphone that I currently use, which is the Ceremonic uh, SRXM1, because it sits right here and it'll block the screen. So either I just got to use a little floofy or I got to find a new microphone. So that is what it is. But this is the kit lens, it's the 16 to 50. Um, so yeah, let's just open this lens real quick. Let's see how small this is. I've heard lots of good reviews on this. I've had the 10 to 18 millimeter lens for wide angle shots, but I like that this is f1.8 and I don't really need the lens to zoom. And the 10 to 18 millimeter was f4, so not really good in low light. And I love a good lens that has good low light performance. So. Here we are. Let's put this here. Sorry if you can hear Angelina Ballerina in the background. And that is what it is. That's my life. So, here we are. Um, so you just match your dots up. Uh oh. Plug it in. It's not bad at all. That's actually kind of just like the 10 to 18. So, let's turn it on. Oh, that's so wide. That is so great. Oh my gosh. And it's it's lightweight because as you guys know, I've been filming on the Sigma 16 millimeter. So this is so light. This is, oh my gosh. So great. Mama, yes. more pouch. More pouch? More pouch, please. All right, I'll get you one. Um, so we've just got our little pancake kit lens right here. Then we have our ZVE10 with the 11 millimeter. I will be doing a vlog on this setup with the kit lens and then with the 11 millimeter. And then I'll do a comparison with the ZV1, which I'm using right now, which I do love this camera. I love it a lot and I will not be selling it. Um, I did that mistake already, sold it and then rebought it because I realized how much I love it in my life. So yeah. Um, yeah, let me get her pouch and then I'll talk more about the camera when I get home. We were actually at the playground right here and we're leaving the playground. It's around 5.30 right now. So we're gonna head home, get dinner, crack a lacken, gotta let the dogs out, do my laundry. Tomorrow's my Friday and I have five days off. So I'm hoping to get a bunch of videos done, my cash stuffing, Friday paycheck, um, I have a paid photo shoot Saturday morning for two hours, so I'm gonna vlog that. And oh, Sunday we're going to Build a Bear for Big Man's first birthday, which is on Monday. I have to order his one year old shirt, I have to also do a photo shoot for his first birthday. I have to order a cupcake. Lots going on, lots going on. Oh, also, my outfit of the day, because I really, really like it. Um, I love this shirt, it's from H&M, their little like, um, crop series. Um, it's like a perfect crop, not too cropped, not too long, perfect. High-waisted jeans are from American Eagle, it's the double ripped. I love that, it shows off my little smiley face tattoo. And then I just have my old navy flip-flops, and then I slicked my hair back into a bun, because I was feeling like a bun look, and I think it's a vibe, I think it's a vibe. So yeah, um, someone's staring at me, so I'm gonna go get this girl pouch and then we're gonna head out. All right, vlog. So we just got home. I gave the kitties a bath. Um, here's one kitty. The other one is still in the bath, um, actually. Uh, she's doing a lush bath bomb. We got a bunch of like Halloween themed bath bombs. So she's doing a black bat one. So it's like, it's completely black in there. Also, I'm about to Brought get to you by my Patreons. Big hey, man. Uh, hello. Stop. Hello. Sorry, my iPad's right there. We're gonna put him in his little pumpkin onesie that was May May's, but um, is now his. So we're gonna put him in that. Um, I've just been watching, or listening to some YouTube videos. Um, hold on. This has like now turned into a vlog. So I got into some shorts, still wearing the same top. 
Um, I have to bring this downstairs. But here is the new baby. I can't get over how light it is. Like, honestly, it kind of feels like the same weight. Um, but also, I've been using the crap out of my Kate Spade Ella tote. I think when I have a tote bag, I just think, oh, I'm going to pack everything I possibly can into it. And so it's like stretching, which I really don't like that. So I think I'm going to switch into a smaller bag. I'm not really sure which one that would be. Um, any of these could be smaller, except for obviously this one. These are all satchels. Um, they go from Cameron satchels to Stacy. There's a Stacy satchel inside this Ella toe, um, and that's also a small Stacy. Um, so I am definitely gonna switch to like a more structured bag. The thing with the pebbled leather on the Ella toe is these are really flimsy. So even though it's a tote bag, it really shouldn't be holding like this much weight. I really shouldn't have like this much stuff in it, but it is what it is. Um, I have my iPad Air box, my what is this macbook air box and my airpods max box right here so i might as well just put a little <laughs> why not let's just put a little sony box right there ta-da um this put right there for now keep the kids water bottles out here big guy you want yours here's yours shake shack receipt don't really need this anymore um my work keys this is a hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. This is my cash stuffing stuff. Like this. This lens can come out. Put that right there. Look at him. He's so lazy. Um, this can come out. And I'm like, oh, a hair tie. Because I don't have enough. Um, yeah, so that's actually... That's good. And that's like a good weight currently. But I'm still gonna change it out. Actually, I might just change into the mini. Let's just change into the mini. It's a vibe. And plus it has like the long strap that's strong. So let's just change into the mini real quick. Here, let's set you up somewhere. Where? I don't know. Um, yeah, I want to give my big Ella toe a little break, a little breaky break. Here, I actually don't want to put you on the bed because the big man's going to come and get you. Here, let's just do this. full but now it's the mini that's all I need in there so we're just gonna close her on up all right perfect and that's exactly what we need so this is what I do see look I just like all stretched out and look at the poor little straps fighting for their dear life and then I have like completely used this bag like love the bag highly recommend the bag have been destroying the bag <laughs> all right but anyway i'm gonna get the kids oh he's playing with a tripod <laughs> i'm gonna get the kids ready for bed i'm gonna set up my outfit for tomorrow because of course i open the store bright and early in the morning um and maybe i'll Mm. I don't think I'll finish this vlog on the ZVE10. I think I'll start a whole new vlog on the ZVE10. So, yeah. I will probably be back when I'm doing laundry or something else. But I gotta get these kids ready. Okay.
it's seven something. Um, I forgot I have my assistant store manager uh, interview tomorrow. So I want to quickly go over my questions and answers that I wrote down and make sure that they're what I want slash like. Um, so I'm gonna quickly do that while the kids are eating. Where's the I'm way too short for this chair? I want to make it shorter. There. All right. Got my laptop here. I'm gonna quickly go over my questions. I also made myself a little iced latte with white mocha and toffee nut and my Nespresso pod. Uh, I use Bianco Leggero or Allegro, whatever it is. Really, really good. Okay. I also have, I said this in like a past clip, I have a photography gig this Saturday. So I want to go over like my plan, my timing, my schedule for this weekend. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to get my AirPods. Okay, we're gonna focus. That's what we're gonna do. this video and get it up for you guys then I'm gonna go my butt to sleep because I have an early morning in the morning so I'm also gonna charge the ZVE 10 and do a vlog on that probably Friday in today's Wednesday so yeah but I'm gonna end this vlog here hopefully I got enough footage for you guys not sure I'm about to find out um, but I love you guys I will see you in the next video bye